going on everyone boss here again this time we're here for slime season three episode 20. uh last time we got the festival eve you know the meeting of all the representatives from the different countries and different places coming to tempest had a nice little dinner um we met the uh rumor officially met the uh the queen of the elves so there was that and you know he he learned about how how epic she is um, and they're going to have a conversation later at some point, so we'll see what, what they talk about when that happens. You know, Rumor's also doing his plans to try to get things, you know, set up distribution around the, uh, the continent um, with the different leaders. I think he wants to talk to everybody about that as well. So a lot of things are brewing for, for the festival in terms of political maneuvers. And then we also have the, the martial arts tournament come up where Hiro Masuki is going to participate. And um, we'll see how that goes. Of course, he doesn't really want to fight, but his his people are are making too much. <laughs> We're gonna have to put him in this place somehow. Um, we also had the, the opening ceremony of the of the festival, so the festival is officially starting. Um, who knows what uh kind of what we're gonna start with this stuff? So are we gonna jump straight into the, the the tournament, or are we gonna get a little bit other things before then? Because um, we've been prepping for a while now, um, so it's about time to enjoy ourselves. Because it's only what twenty four episodes in the season, so we're not far from the season being over. We'll see how. How things go. So what for the do? Let's jump this episode. Oh yeah, they they didn't realize he was the king. That's why they had that like gas Pikachu face. That's up, sir. Alright, Hinata, watch these kids. Oh, uh oh, oh. Yeah, she brought she brought a sword on a kid. Yeah, alright. Alright, not over kids. Oh. Luminous is here. What do we got? Oh, we got a performance. Okay. Are we going to get the whole thing? Oh, we got uh, a whole orchestra. We got all the different species too participating. That's good. Harmony between species. Let's see if that lasts. Oh, no clapping. Oh. Okay, what's up? What are they about to do? Yeah, I don't know about Xion, but we will see. I mean, she's good at this. I like that for sure. Okay. I was not expecting this. But I dig it. All right, room. You spitting room room? Oh. I like that, cool. Everybody's all struck. Oh, Luminous is clapping. Yo, the River Road Dome. Oh, that's a train. I see it. These are going to prevent trains. They can heal a sword with a potion. Ooh, uh, okay, we getting some soul stuff here. Is it like if it's a famous sword, a Mato? 
It'll come back to life. Yo, it really did heal the sword. That's crazy. Yeah, see the weapon have to be grown. Okay. Yo. They get deep into it. Ah, magic kills evolved the weeds. They're making groundbreaking discoveries. Yeah. Yeah, so because Valdora's around, a whole bunch of them grew. And the Doris, too, yeah. Ah, we go got some scholars pulling up. There you go. Yo, this girl's been eating the whole day. Oh. Yo, straight to violence. Culture exchange. That dude is definitely a vampire. Look at him. <laughs> Secret of faith and grace. Yeah, give it to me. Oh. So he can, like, bless people? Alright. Just like that, learn. Ah, we got some dissidents here. He said, yeah, you're a demon lord, you gotta uphold yourself. So who's the two? Is it Yuki and... I don't think Yuki would be exposed like that. That's probably the, what's her name? The blonde girl? There you go, Valdor. <laughs> They're like, yeah, you didn't check what they were doing? No money. They'll tell me they burnt through the budget on day one. Oh, okay. Not a budget issue. All right. Oh, uh, they have too much money, <laughs> too much value. Need some currency exchange. Can you trade some of the stuff for the coin that you need? Or will it take a while? Oh, she had a good point. Look at her. Yeah, yeah she look at her coming up. Musical performance, having good ideas. Oh, Diablo's getting, <laughs> getting into it. Yeah. Destroying councils. Okay. We can make money during the festival, right? Ah, uh, you can't just bend over for anything. <laughs> Don't think too much about it, just do whatever. Betty Mara, I was wondering why he was dressed differently. Oh, not too much fun. 
Oh, tournament time! Next episode. All right, um, that was this week's episode of Slime. Um, the festival's underway. We have, you know, everybody enjoying themselves. A lot of eating going on. All the kids had food. <laughs> um, Hinata took care of the, the kids. They so they met her and they know that she's uh, she's his student. So there's that connection now. Um, Rimuru met up with Luminous. They had their talk. They have, you know, talked about culture exchange and she taught him a technique that will help people that believe in him to use his power. So I guess kind of like how her, her followers can use her like holy magic and stuff. Um, Rimuru's followers would be able to use, I guess he said holy magic too. So um, that'd be cool to see whenever it comes to the action. I feel like Shuna would be good at that. Um, and speaking of Shuna, Shuna and Shion, um, had a little musical performance. They look really cool. I like the, like the outfits. To the, they, look, uh, they look nice. Um, and they did play good music. They impressed everybody. Um, and then they had the whole orchestra performance too. And then they had the the presentation that they talked about. Um, uh, making major discoveries. <laughs> and presenting them to the world. So we're going to have a lot of scholars coming in, into Tempest as well. So everything's looking good. Except for the whole issue with the money. Um... But it seems like they'll just not think too hard about it. So I think it, it'll work out in the end of end of things. Because um, it's not like they're broke. It's just that they're, they're what they have and value doesn't just translate to just straight coin. And they can't just like give it out like that. Um, but I'm sure they'll figure it out. They had their fun. And now we're here at the, the martial arts tournament. Um, I don't know how, if it's going to be a whole arc or multiple episodes. Because I figure most, most of the fights are going to be one shot. I don't know how many participants there are. If it's like... 64 or something. A lot of them is going to be just one hit done, one hit done. Uh, especially if a lot of people from Tempest participate. I don't know who all from Tempest is participating. Um, but we know the hero is participating. And he'll probably get through it pretty easily until, unless he plays somebody from Tempest. Um, yeah. The only guess I have is, I know from the opening, it looks like Geld might be participating in Gul Gulbata, maybe. Uh, I don't think like people like Benny Morrow or or Veldor's participant. They're too strong. Any of the Demon Lords, I don't think so. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> um, yeah, I think he's just like, if it's somebody from Tempest, it might, I don't want to say Geld is weak, but he's like a strong like leader of the village, but he's not like super strong. Like, he's not like Demon Lord or like, Benmar was probably not even Demon Lord level either, but he's probably pretty strong. He, he's like revered as a, they say like a local deity. Deity. Uh, so I don't think any of the, like, the, the Oni are fighting. Uh, maybe she, she might stick her way in there. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see. I think we'll only focus on like fights between characters we know. Um, so that'll be interesting to see uh, how that comes about. And uh, who makes it far, who wins. Uh, we'll see how short it is. Cause I don't feel like it's going to be like, you know, like on Dragon Ball Z, you had arcs. Or Yu Yu Hakusho, you had an arc before the tournament. I think it'd be pretty short, maybe two episodes, uh, if that. <laughs> but I'm still looking forward to it. And then there's the whole thing about there's two people with ominous auras here um, that Luminous pointed out to Rimuru, and Rimuru's like, yeah, no. So we'll see. It's, I think one should be the the blonde hair girl that we've seen. I forgot her name. Is her name Marbell? That name is popped up in my head. I don't know if that's from here or not. Um, and then the only other one I would think of is Yuki. Um, but I don't know if Yuki would give himself away like that, having an ominous aura around him. Because uh, Rumda has suspected him for doing stuff before. So, we'll see. Um, but yeah, we uh, will continue on to the, the next episode next time. So, until then.